Ladies and gentlemen, welcome. Shaney Boy here at the Crane Trust Nature and Visitor Center where they are celebrating their 40th anniversary. So let's go see what they got. some more artwork and photographs on display actually these are these are for sale look at those storm clouds but over here is an actual buffalo he's quite large and a beaver there are some Something back there. But yes, look at this buffalo. There's a table full of wood sculptures. Carved out of wood. I really like this one. A little lump. For just a mere hundred dollars, we could get it. This is what the sandhill crane looks like. And here's the whooping crane in this lovely room of death. If you look at the map, you can see that people from all over the country have visited here, as well as lots of people from Nebraska. And people from all over the world, really. Lots of visitors. They even have some bugs on display. Grasshoppers and crickets. Flies. They have a nice butterfly garden set up out here in this trail. We're going to see where it takes us. For those who are curious, this is the skeletal anatomy of a crane. Skeletal, skeletal anatomy. So, it's me and my nephew walking on this trail I think I think there's some buffalo up ahead possibly we'll find out shortly but it's a warm sunny day the birds are singing the birds are flying all over when we first arrived the, the barn swallows were swooping pretty close to us as we were walking up to the building. Yeah, it's a beautiful day. We're now on this trail. Sure smells nice out here. Love that fresh air. Even some butterflies flying around. Butterflies. butterflies. Let's go see what's over here. We'll take a look and see what this what the sign says. I think it says do not enter. It does indeed say do not enter. Because on the other side of this are buffalo. However, 
I think they are somewhere hidden from our view. Probably in the shade somewhere. Trying to stay warm. Trying to stay cool. It's already it's already warm. Uh, yeah. I think I think that's what they're trying to do. Trying to stay cool. We're gonna do some more walking. Some more walking to see what we can to see what we can find. Alright. To see what we can find. We've made it over to the Platte River. Where there's a bridge crossing it. And another bridge over there. This view it's pretty awesome. It's windy up here. But it is definitely cool. I'm gonna tip. Alright. Oh. Okay. He threw a shoe down. That was. Whoa. That was, that was, uh, climatic. Right here. We are at the bridge. We've made a strange discovery. How did that get there? Ew. If you should decide to ever visit this place, remember, please, don't smoke. We want to, we want to keep it nice out here. It is quite warm, especially when we're in direct sunlight. But that's part of summer, I suppose. We crossed the first bridge. We're on a little trail here that connects to the second bridge. So that's where we're going. We're gonna see what's on the other side of that. Lots of, lots of vegetation. Lots of pretty flowers out here. All right. And here we are on the second bridge where they have a couple benches. I think this would be a good place to take a break from walking for those who are tired. You can sit here and look out at the water. Apparently there is fish out there. Well, you are correct. There are fish swimming in the water. Well, that does it for the for the bridge. Starting right here, there are some hiking trails that go through this prairie here which we aren't going to do today because like I said it is hot 
but we will be out here another time to do a nice little hike through the prairie land. I had to stop here once again and look at the water. You can hear the wind blowing through the through the trees. Birds are singing. It is very pretty out here. Very peaceful. And there's definitely a fish down in the water. Not sure if you can see it, but he is down there. I'm not sure how well you can see it. We got a fish swimming against the current. So right now, we're crossing back over the bridges, heading back up to the center. I think we're gonna make a quick walk through to the gift shop. And then that'll probably be the end of our time here today. This place is very cool. Um, they're not very busy today. This is their third day of their 40th anniversary celebration. They had some all sorts of festivities going on the past two days. And then today, Today's a pretty quiet day. Bridal wreath. Always loved bridal wreath. What are these things growing on this tree? I guess that's what it is. They almost look like grapes. They but feel furry. They feel furry. Wait, let Fuzzy. Me Fuzzy grapes, do not eat that. I'm gonna squish it. Do not eat it. Okay. It's powerful. It must be some type of nut or seed or something. Just I'm gonna We're gonna we're gonna, gonna leave those them. alone. If you know what those are, let us know. We're curious. It's a, probably a kind of nut. What kind of nut? Could that possibly be? This is pretty cool. We have made our way back to the building. So I think now we're going to walk through the gift shop real quick and then we're gonna leave. So I think that about does it for this video. Thank you for watching. Come back soon. Bye.